Uh, hello everyone, uh, it's Comfort Pizza Mbesh and I'm back with another offering. So in this tutorial, I'm going to teach you how to integrate Sparkle Pay to your, web, to your WordPress website. So uh, in the last episode, I introduced you to us the Sparkle Pay of which I said that like uh, it's a very powerful payment gateway system. Yeah, so uh, before we get started, there are some things that we need to know or something that you have to understand before we jump into uh sparkle pay so uh make sure that uh you have these documents mentioned over here i'm going to zoom it a bit so uh these documents if you're if you're registering uh on behalf of a company you need certificate of registration and cooperation these documents so you can uh you, you can pause this video for a bit you have a look at uh these details so uh before we go to the real code, then like before we start coding, before we start interacting the Sparkle payments with a, a real programming language, I, I would like to show you how to do it on WordPress. We, WordPress is a content management system. Yeah, it's a content management system. We don't have to write. We are not going to write any code over here. Yeah, you, we are not going to write any code. Everything is going to be direct. So uh, let. Let's get started. So, uh, what I've done here is I've I've done a fresh WordPress install without any extension or plugin installed. So, uh, here it is. It's on under my cognito. So, what I'm going to do first here on the plugin section, I'm going to add new. I'm, I'm going to install WooCommerce. I'm going to install WooCommerce WordPress plugin. So, WooCommerce WordPress plugin. It's uh, a plugin which allows which allows us to turn our WordPress site into an e-commerce platform. Wow, it's a very powerful one. So after we're done with this one, I'm going to also install Sparkle Pay plugin, and then we're going to configure our extensions. No, sorry, our APIs. Sure. So mostly depends on the server network speed on this one. So this setup wizard I'm, I'm not going to do anything with it as at now i'm just going to skip it so i'm going to go back to the previous page yeah so what i'm going to do over here is i'm going to search for sparkle sparkle pay the plugin sparkle let's try sparkle yeah sparkle this one make sure that it's this one the this yeah yeah exactly i activate it so now uh, our site is ready to start uh, our, our site is ready to start working with sparkle so what i'm going to do next is i'm going to install uh, a friendly an e-commerce friendly uh, template or theme on our wordpress so i'm going to search on themes so i'm going to install add new I'm just going to install a theme which is uh, comfortable with uh, what's this uh, with work e-commerce. So I'm going to search anything like store. Yeah, store. All right, wait a bit. Come on. All right, I'm going to. All right, all right. So here it is. Okay, okay, okay. Storefront. Which one are we going to go with? All right, so let, I'm going to go with uh, Fashion Storefront, which is uh, this one. I'm going to install it. Uh, it looks so beautiful. All right, all right. And then I'm going to activate it. I'm going to activate it. So, boom. Our site is now ready to be turned into uh, an e-commerce platform. Our site is ready. Yeah. So what I'm going to do over here is I'm going to install some demos. I'm going to install some demos. I'm going to install some demos. Yeah, demo import. Yeah, so I'm going to go with this yellowish. Yes, import demo. So this one to come with like a uh, random how can i say random products yeah which is uh, very good for our testing purposes it's going to come with our uh, random products all right okay 
our import was ready. Woo! Awesome. Let's see what we have. Come on. Ah. What could be the problem? Install plugins. Okay, let's try install plugins. Maybe there are some missing plugins over here. There are some missing plugins. Oh, yeah, yeah. Exactly, exactly. Okay, so let's make sure that we install these plugins uh, before we get started. Yeah, let's make sure that we configure these plugins so they are installed. The next step is to activate them. Alright, so uh, let's set up our homepage now. You know, uh, this is an e-commerce uh, platform, so it would require setting up like uh, a custom page. Yeah, a custom page for uh, listing the products. So I'm going to click on customize. Demo impact. Let's see. Okay. Tala, 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 tala. Network. I don't know. Ah, it's, it's not working as, a, as, a, as I was expecting the network today. Ah, I don't know what could be the problem. Static page. Okay, so let's just create a new page. I'm going to say home. And then add, and then we're going to make this one as the home page. That's what we're going to have. Sure, let's publish it. And then I'm going to, yeah, I'm going to import. Yeah, going to import. Okay, it's working, working, working. Visit my site. Let's see what we have here. All right, all right. I don't want to say much. So what I'm going, to, what we're going to focus on this shop page, which is right here. We're going to focus on this. Yeah. So as as you can see, our uh, our product page is empty. There's nothing over here. So inside the shop page. So uh, what I'm going to do over here next is um, we're going to configure now the Sparkle plugin. I don't want to take much of the time trying to configure this. All comments you can figure it out on your own yeah, you can figure it out on your own so what i'm going to do over here is i'm going to click on all comments all comments and then settings and then you cl click on payments payments before that you need we're going to go back to the general settings so we need to activate sparkle pay Enable Sparkle Pay. Sure. Good, good, good. So what we're going to do over here is uh, we're going to put our public and secret key. So uh, in the last step, in the last session, uh, we created like a Sparkle Payment account or let's say Sparkle Pay account. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to get those API keys and then I'm going to paste them over here. I'm going to log into my Spark account. Okay, so I'm going to log into my Spark account, which we created. Uh, which we created last night in the yeah in the last session. So I log in. Bingo! This is our account. So what I'm going to do next is to click on settings. Yeah. So this is my public key. This is my public key. And then I'm going to put it here. Uh, my secret key. Yeah, so I know some people are wondering, like, why does this man always expose the, these keys? Yeah, I know that these keys are so confidential, but what I mostly do for just, like, uh, for just for the purpose of teaching you guys how to handle this, that's the reason why I show you uh, my keys. But... Uh, what I mostly do is that just after this session, I will change these keys. I update, yeah, I will update them. And uh, for the matter of fact that, uh, for the matter of fact is that I, what, what can I say? I don't 
can I say I don't publish my watch this my live keys so these are just test keys my account is not yet active we're just using it for testing purposes so I'm going to save changes yeah so uh all right to fill in this on work e-commerce okay city you enter your city you enter your country zambia zambia central postal code and then the last thing the currency so me i'm from zambia we must we we, we use uh Zambian quach, so I'm going to choose uh, Zambian quach. So now uh, our store is now ready to go. Woo! Just like a charm. So what I'm going to do here next is I'm going to add a product. So here on products, I'm going to click on products. All right, so I'm going to click on create product. Yeah, so I'm going to say, uh, I'm going to say there's something Zambian. So I'm going to say uh, Masuku. Masuku ga gallon, yeah, Masuku gallon. Then, uh, yeah, Masuku gallon as the product title. And, uh, okay. So, let's wait for it to load. And, oh, let's just wait. It for, we'll just, let's just wait for it to load. It shouldn't take this long. I'm refreshing my page. That could be the problem now. Okay, so uh, I think this this seems to be a network problem. Yeah, this sounds, yeah. All right, we're good to go. So the description I'm going to say uh tasty masokus, masokus, tasty masokus, and then the regular price. I mean, let's just say uh, two fifty for a gallon. Yeah, uh, let's say the sale price. Nah, nah, nah. <laughs> yeah okay so i'm going to publish it i don't want to complicate things here eh? just want to make this video straightforward as possible yeah so ah uh, just publish so what i'm going to do next here is i'm going to refer i'm going to click on shop page from my site All right, so here it is, uh, Masuku. Oh, so I come to the site and I find like, oh, some Masuku. Okay, let's see. Let me check the description. Okay, so, all right, all right, all right. Ah, okay. It's 250, so I'm going to click on Add to Cut. Wow, wow, wow. Sure, so the next thing is to view Cut. Yeah, yeah, so, ah. Uh, so this is my cut. I proceed to check out. Let's see now the magic of Sparkle. All right, all right. Yeah, so let's say you fill in with your, fill, your first name and then your last name. Ah, it's a mesh. Okay. okay, company with levels uh, Innovation Limited. Uh, limited. Ah, okay, country Zambia. All right, home address. Ah, home address. This is, this, this is something street address this is something i can't okay so a street address let me just say odd evole odd evole low okay so there's there's a phone call which has come over here uh just a minute i'll be here all right from my back on track it was just a simple phone call and then here you fill in with your city and then the country sorry the state Oh, the province i choose this one your postal code i'm going to use mine and then you also enter your phone number Hello. yeah and then your email your email and even type in your email at gmail.com sure, 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 sure. and then the next thing i'm going to click on proceed with proceed to spark so i uh, now see the magic see the magic unfortunately your order cannot be okay let's see uh, 
Okay. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Okay. What a good all right, all right, all right, let's see. Ah network. Alright, so I'm going to click to proceed to Sparkle. If it if yeah, so unfortunately your order cannot be processed as the originating bank merchant has declined your transaction. Please attempt your purchase again. Yeah, so uh let me let me pause this video a bit and try out with uh, my live keys. Yeah, my live my, my live keys. So I'm going. All right, fam. We ended from here. So uh, I'm I'm going to retry the checkout now. I've updated my keys with the live ones in the background as I pause the video. All right, let's see what we're going to have now. All right, yeah, it has worked. Woo! So here's the magic now. So. There are a number of uh, like payment methods. We have Visa, Mobile Money, Airtel, and Zamtel. Yeah. A number of them. So I'm going to go with uh, uh, Airtel. So if you click on uh, Airtel, you just have to punch in with your details. You punch in with your details and then on the payment side, Yeah, anyway, no problem. Uh, there's no problem with the public key. <laughs> There's no problem with the public key unless the secret. So uh uh when you punch when you punch in, you see uh can I say when you punch in and then you it's going to prompt for a payment and then everything will be done and it will be updated. Wow now now you'll you'll be safe and good to go. Safe and good to go. All right, so that's all for this story, and that's how we integrate Sparkle Pay to, uh, to your website. So, uh, in case if you have like uh, any query uh, or anything, you can kindly uh, reach out to me using uh, using these contact details, using these contact details, using these contact details. So I'm going to, so for the email contact kindly use uh, weeklevels04 at gmail.com uh, for whatsapp only whatsapp only whatsapp only only whatsapp 26096879 facebook at comfort Comfort be chambers. So uh that's all for this story, Jesus. Oh, sorry, no Jesus. So that's all for this story, guys. Uh see, see you in the next episode of which are going to start like the live programming. Now we're going to write codes, codes, yeah, codes. Anyway, talking is you. Bye guys, see you next time.